Welcome to the Inlet Studio. I mean, I'm joined today by Fabio Ferranese, head of Inel's Grid Digital Hubs. Welcome, Fabio. Hi, Jonathan. And Inel has a strong record, a long track record in digitalization. And can you talk us briefly through that journey and what the next steps are? Well, yes, very briefly. I, I just remember the days when we started working at the first massive uh, remote metering system. It was almost the last century. So from there, a lot of times passed. But um, going very quickly onwards, uh, I think that some key milestones were our full migration to the cloud, which took place five years ago. Then the adoption of new architecture standards based on microservices to exiting the, the silos era. And then eventually envisaging the idea of um, digital twin concept. And uh, ending, uh, coming to the recent year, with a new vision of uh, software development for energy company based on a platform approach, which uh, allows from one side to leverage on the new coming technology, name it drones, uh, IoT, AI, what you name it, but also on different stakeholders and different uh, partners. The idea is to create an ecosystem so that things can be done quickly and together. And, and one of those new innovations is, is the metaverse, and I believe Enel calls it the gridverse. So what, what do you mean by that? It is a strange word, maybe the, even difficult to pronounce for somebody. But the idea is that we are again at a tipping point of technology. So we have uh, many energy companies, manufacturer companies have uh, Mm, generated a big expertise uh, on the concept of digital twins. So we have digital twins for turbines, for plants, for networks, I mean electric networks and things like this. Mm -hmm. And on the other hand, we also have gained a lot of experience on the collaboration. We are coming from a social era, um, so we, we know what it is, uh, what it means by collaborating on network platform, on social platform, things like this. So if you just think of mixing the two, so having a kind of collaborative digital twin, that is where the metaverse for energy comes for uh, for the electric line, net, electric network comes, so that we call the, the gridverse. It is a, a place, a virtual place, where you have a model of your assets, but where you can collaborate, you can meet people and create a, a business cases which make sense. So can you dive a bit more deeply into, into those business cases for energy utilities? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. For example, you can directly inherit some of the business cases coming from the um, older idea of the digital twins, for example, virtual training. But uh, typically on digital twin, you have a virtual map of a part of your network, and then you train your uh, um, crew staff in uh, doing normal maintenance activities. Well, on the grid verse, you can do them together. So people can mutually interact and learn from one another and work in a more realistic approach. Then you can also have a more effective uh, remote assistance or remote test uh, approaches so that uh, you can mix also not only the, the social with the digital twin but also with the reality so you can have uh, approaches like augmented reality and pushing farther with that approach you can think about next level engineering approaches where you can is even um, think of a collaborative design of secondary substation and things like this and if you go still farther you think if you adopt it our idea of the grid verse, which is an open metaverse based on standard description of data and standard data links exchange, you can also think of inter inter DSO scenarios so that you can, for example, uh, run benchmark to different energy di distributed system operator and also facilitating the interaction between DSO. So it is a kind of a, a community of the future based uh, on the virtual world which is based on the grid. So it's that going to rev revolutionize the, in the utility industry then? I, I really hope so. <laughs> Thank you for your uh, uh, input, Fabio. It was, uh, you're more than welcome. For more insights into the industry, 
tune into our, our Mnet channels on Mnet.world. Thank you.